Hey everyone, my name is Gilberto and we are back again with another battle spot session and we are rocking out with this squad as we have been for a little while and we are going through every dang mega in the decks with the Tyranitar and the Pinsir here. So let's see what we can do. I'm a big fan of this team even though it's been a little bit unlucky and the matchups have been a little awkward but we're here. We have a Charizard Gardevoir, Azumarill, Greninja, Az Aegislash and Gyarados. So two Ubers straight off the bat. And two Ubers straight off the bat. I am going to bring Rotom. Definitely bring in Rotom. I'm gonna lead Rotom actually. I'm gonna lead Rotom. And then I'm bringing Cobalion. Rotom, Cobalion, Pinsir is what I would like to do. Right? Is that what I do? That's absolutely what I do, yep. Common weaknesses. Uh, Cobalion gets protected by Rotom a little bit. Yeah, I think that's what we do. Because honestly, I've been pretty bad about just uh, bringing out three mons and then realizing that like two of those three mons are both weak to the same thing and then just gets swept by something. So it's not the best, it's not the best. I'm trying to get better at that. There should be no glaring weaknesses other than fire, but we can deal with that. We can deal with that, especially since it's just a Charizard. Rotom can always come in and uh, outspeed, take a hit and then outspeed it next turn and just take it out. So, we're in here with a Greninja. Now, you don't think that I'm Scarfed, or do you? I don't know. I'm going to Discharge here. I'm just going to Discharge. I'm going to show off the set. We are Scarfed. We are Scarfed. Discharge, Volt Switch, Shadow Ball, and Will-O-Wisp. Now, I think we'll be fine with a Will-O-Wisp, actually, right? I'm gonna... Uh, I'm sorry, no, for the Volt Switch. I'm gonna Volt Switch here. I think I'm gonna Volt Switch. We do on speed, obviously. Get the Volt Switch off, and do we just take you out? You're sashed. Okay. No, you're not sashed. Interesting. So, I absolutely 100% should have discharged, and I made a mistake. Mistakes were made, guys. Now, if I go into Cobalion, I don't quite know what you do. I don't quite know what you do, but we get the free swamp in a Cobalion. You go for the Dark Pulse, which I should resist, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, yeah, we take that okay. And we get the Justified. We're not a physical attacker, but we do get the Justified boost regardless. We do get the Justified boost regardless. Oh, and your Life Orb, so you take yourself out. Okay. So we're fine. We're fine. I'm fine with that interaction. I'm fine with that interaction. And we just have my boy Cobalion out here. Some people say Cobalion. I don't know. Maybe that's a thing. Tell me that that's a thing. Out comes the Gyarados. Oh, you don't know yet that I'm not, um, that I'm not physical. So you were trying to counteract my justified boost. Either way, I Thunder Wave this thing every dang day of the week. I'm going to show off my set. Now, I should preface this before I show this, that this is a slightly bulkier Cobalion. I'm max HP, max speed, and I... The idea is to take a hit, set up a Calm Mind, get the Thunder Wave off, and then get hits off. Um, but I have to Thunder Wave and get the heck out of here, because unless you Mega Evolve, actually, unless you Mega Evolve, I literally can't touch you. So, I should be fine getting this Thunder Wave off, and then as you Waterfall me, which is adorable, that should not do much at all, I don't think. Yeah, that doesn't do much at all. Okay. So now you're Thunder Waved, and you got a useless Waterfall off. And actually, you still don't know that I'm a special Cobalion. <laughs> I'm realizing. So, I think I feel like it's too obvious to go into Rotom. But I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to do it anyway. Rotom is absolutely my play. Rotom is absolutely my play. And then I just Volt Switch. Because if this thing stays in, it's times four a week, and I'm... You thunder wave me! Oh, that is fan freaking tastic. That is fan freaking tastic. I get the free volt switch off. If you want to swap, you go ahead, BB. You go ahead. Oh man, we are making the accidental reads. I went into Rotom. I was gonna go into Rotom anyway, cause I cannot touch this thing. All I wanted to do is get a thunder wave off and then dip. But you went for the thunder wave on my Cobalion. That is wonderful. That is wonderful. And. Out comes the Gardevoir, and I just get the free, the 100% free swap into Cobalion here. 
Oh, this is a fun one. Okay, now I now I shouldn't I shouldn't uh, start freaking out already because you could obviously just switch into the Gyarados, and I can't touch again. Again, cannot touch Gyarados. So I think I'm gonna double. I think I'm gonna double into Pinsir because okay. So this is my thinking, right? So there's a chance that. You know that I'm gonna swap into into Rotom, and you attack. You stay in an attack, right? Well, no, I don't think it matters. I mean, I outspeed anyway, right? I definitely outspeed turn one. I definitely outspeed turn one. See, so yeah, just get the flash cannon off. I'm gonna get the flash cannon. I'm, I'm not gonna overthink this too much. And I still have Pinsir in the back, so even if you live, Pinsir can clean that one up, and then Rotom can clean up the Gyarados. So yeah, I think I'll, I'll be fine. I'm not gonna overthink this one. I'm not going to overthink this one. You do Mega Evolve, and you will get hella special defense, but I think getting this off is worth it. I think getting this off is worth it. I feel like it does 50% minimum. 50%? Yeah, that's about right. That's about right. Okay. You side shock me. I feel like I take that. I feel like I take that. Oh, we've taken that fine, boys. We've taken that fine. But once again... This thing can't touch Gyarados, so that's something to have in the back of my head. But either way, Pinsir cleans up. You don't get priority. Pinsir cleans this interaction up. And I'm going to focus Fla uh, uh, Flash Cannon, the Gyarados. I'm curious to see how much it does. We can see how much it does. But honestly, it doesn't... I don't know what exactly you do at this point, either way. You could Waterfall me, which is fine. Uh, and, and now this is where I go into Pinsir because Pinsir can take a hit. I get the I get the quick attack off, and then Rotom. I get a free swap into Rotom. We get the Volt Switch off. If you want to swap into uh, Guard of War, then yeah. I mean that's obviously what I do here. That's obviously what I do here. I feel like I take a Waterfall and then I just get the quick attack. Actually no, I, well yeah okay. I, and then I just get the quick attack off and we go from there. And this is clearly a bulkier set. Because I feel like an offensive Gyarados does much more than that. But we're just going to make Evolve get the quick attack off. Now, this is go this battle is going a bit slower than a normal battle should. But, I mean, unfortunately, this is what we got to do just because... Oh, you're Rocky Helmet. Yeah, so you're a super defensive Gyarados set. Okay, no, that's fine. That's fine. And we live in, so we can take we can hit you one more time. I know this is a slow going battle, so I'm sorry about that if you guys are tuned out already, but uh this is just how we have to play because obviously this is uh, a weird matchup. This is a weird matchup. We have to we can't just go in guns blazing, we have to kinda play a little bit conservatively just so we don't get put in a bad position because if I let Rotom take a hit from the Gardevoir then Rotom goes down I think so I can't let that happen obviously <laughs> obviously so we have to play a little bit safe just to not let my freaking I mean if even if my Cobalion if I had let my Cobalion get get um Thunder Wave then this battle would have been way different. This battle would have been completely different. But as it stands, we are in the best position possible. We have the Cobalion against the Mega Gardevoir, and with a Rotom in the back. So we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Actually, I could have just discharged and gotten a discharge, uh, taken out the Gyarados, and then got also gotten a discharge off on the uh, Gardevoir. That was also a thing I could have done, but I didn't, so it's okay. We we will have that opportunity to get a discharge off if somehow this Cobalion goes down, but we just win the match with a Flash Cannon. That was a wild match. We had to play, again, we had to play that a little bit deliberately, a little bit slowly, but uh, we had a clear path to victory, and it was just a matter of taking those steps on that path. In any case, thank you guys so much for watching. We have battle spot sessions every dang day of the week. We have TCG Ho battles uh, at least twice a week, and we open up TCG at least once a week. But as always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will be once again out.